Supreme defeated the team of Trish Stratus and Tori Wilson. Thank you once again, ladies and gentlemen, for tuning in to this edition of a Tuesday Night Bomb. I am Johnny Babaganoush, and we're going to have ourselves one hell of a night. We still have a wet and wild qualifier later on tonight between the ring veteran, the ring legend pretty much, Alicia and Alaska, Nebraska. Those two, those two divas have had many battles and now this time the winner gets to compete at the wet and wild contest at Beach Blast. I'm looking forward to that. But also, ladies and gentlemen, main event tonight, Shane Eaton McKay and Player Uno. No disqualifications, no count outs. We're going to have a winner tonight. I cannot wait for it. Who will join Titanium? And we're missing one more opponent. Well, coming up next, ladies and gentlemen, we have ourselves some high-flying cruiserweight action. Chavo Guerrero Jr. and Shelton Benjamin. Let's hope and pray that that Chavo wins this match. That man earned, deserves, and earns a victory over Benjamin. We'll meet you at ringside for the action here on Tuesday night. I don't know. I had the impression that maybe you were uh, oh, you were working non-stop. Tell me that you're from Orangeburg, South Carolina. Weighing in at 245 pounds, Shelton. <laughs> and anyways, ladies and gentlemen, we're back on the air here, and um, moments, but moments ago, folks, before commercial break, soup and sandwich, Mrs. Jeremy and Cactus Jen putting themselves up for their big tag team match against the perfect crime. Looking forward to that one. And hopefully they both and do the, uh, launch the lunch punch. The lunch punch. Chavo to both Perfect Sean and Lawless for what happened last week on Tuesday Night Bomb. The deal was made but followed by a knuckle sandwich to the flaming fist. And then Perfect Crime just walk out of the ring, backpedaling, pointing and laughing. There ain't nothing, there ain't nothing funny about punching your boss, who's the one who's giving you paychecks. Cruiserweight action next. Say. That's exactly what Chavo is trying to do with Shelton Benjamin. Oh, nice trip there by Chavo. Don't get too cocky now. No. This side stepper can really mess you up. Standing side kick. Wow. And that punch sends Chavo to the ground. Wink, wink, wink. I didn't know that. I didn't know that it makes a squeaky sound when you're trying to grind someone's skull. <laughs> wow, a cradle launching suplex. Learn something new every day. Like, how can it squeak? One, two, and almost a three count there. Come on there, Chavo. You're the next star to go for that Cruiserweight Championship. Nice! Nice! To the back of the skull of Shelton! <laughs> going around the ring, trying to, trying to strategize what they're going to do next. Shelton Benjamin last week teamed up with Orlando Jordan, Booker T. Knight in the house. He was too disgusted over that defeat at THQ Knight. Look at this! Oh, he misses it! I can't believe he missed it! One! Two! Counting down! Three! Gentlemen, get back in the ring! This is no laughing matter! Five! Don't, don't, don't do any backflips there, Chavo! 
Oh, nice punch to the face. Ah, oh, misses the splash. There was no water in the pool. One. High flying or not, that is a very nasty spill for Chavo, and he cannot risk anything. Oof. Oof. Oh, a, a abdominal stretch. We, have, we don't. We don't. We honestly, we don't see those kinds of moves anymore. I mean, we most certainly don't see them in, 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 in independent wrestling as well. Uh. One. Boom, boom, bam, boom. Two. Now hold the phones here. Four. Submission hold. We don't want any of that crap nonsense outside the ring forcing these men to be counted out. Not on my watch. Three. This is the most strangest of sounds. Oh, this guy suddenly ducks underneath. <laughs> Snap mirror. What's Chavo gonna do next? He's so mysterious. He's gonna go for a power bomb. Wait a second, there's that. That's a gory special chest first as opposed to face first. Now Chavo trying to get the crowd all revved up. Oh, misses the cross chop. Uh. Jesus. All those combinations of strikes. And now Benjamin pumping himself up. Ah. Oof. Nice. Uses the top rope to his leverage. Off the rope. And he takes him out with a shot. More taunting and showboating from the number one contender, Chavo Guerrero Jr. In recent years for Chavo in TNA, not only has he lost the tag titles with Hernandez, but he's not going to be part of the Bound for Glory series. Hernandez will. Now why would TNA management do that, huh? Why would they put tag team partners against each other? I mean, that's not the point of a tag team. Oh, nice! One. Flying a hit scissors! Two! Wait a second! Hold the phones! Oh no! Four! Five! Oh no, he flew too far and that, as a result, Six. is gonna get screwed over! Seven! Eight! Nine. Get up! He's not gonna get up, Captain Obvious. He's Ten. down and he's... But for a count out, that's kind of bullshit. Are we gonna allow this? Here's your winner, Shelton. Are we gonna allow this for real? A count out? That's bullshit. Technically, Shelton Benjamin could have grabbed Ch Chavo Guerrero and bring him inside the ring. Why didn't he do that? That doesn't, that doesn't make any sense, ladies and gentlemen, but facts are facts, and, Sh and, and Shelton Benjamin wins the match by a countout, which we will not be getting in that qualifying match between Uno and Shaggy McKay. We're going to have a winner like it or not. Stick around, ladies and gentlemen, we have a lot more action, and speaking of qualifying matches, up next, we've got... Hot Diva Action, Alaska, Nebraska, and Alicia, those two alley cats are going to be battling out. The winner will join Pain in the Wet and Wild Contest at Beach Blast. Don't go anywhere, ladies and gentlemen. Back from commercial break, ladies and gentlemen, this just in next week. On a Tuesday night, Bob, we're gonna have no countouts, no disqualifications. Chavo Guerrero Jr. and Shelton Benjamin. Introducing first from Toronto, Ontario, Canada. Meanwhile, ladies and gentlemen, back in the ring, we got Alicia, the ring veteran, a ring legend here, multi-time.